Hello, welcome to English for Everyone. Today we're talking about get. Get is the most commonly used word and it's used in the most different ways. Today we're going to talk about a few. This is part one. The pronunciation of get. G. E. Get. But we use a stop T for the T so it sounds like get. You put your tongue up and stop. Get. Not get. T. No T. Get. In the past, ga. G. A. Ga. T. With a stop T. Ga. Ga. We use get in many ways. Let's look at a few. So first, get is the same as receive. You receive a present or you get a present. She is getting a present. Or in the past, she got a present. Let's look at pronunciation. Pronunciation, getting. G, e, d, ged, e, getty, mm, getting. So we see the T from get changes to a D for continuous action, getting. She's getting a present today. Now, in the past, got. She got a present. The T changes to a D. Together, g, a, ga, God, a, uh, gada. She got a present. She got a present. Pronunciation with a D. She got a present for her birthday. Let's practice. Why is she excited? She is excited because she's getting a present. Why is she excited? Respond. Very good. Is she getting a present on her birthday? Yes, she is getting a present on her birthday. Is she getting a present on her birthday? Respond. Very good. Why is he happy? He is happy because he got a letter. Why is he happy? Respond. Very good. Did he get a letter from his parents? Yes, he got a letter from his parents. Did he get a letter from his parents? Respond. Very good. Why is he happy? He is happy because he got a phone call. Why is he happy? Respond. Very good. Did he get a phone call from his girlfriend? Yes, he got a phone call from his girlfriend. Did he get a phone call from his girlfriend? Respond. Very good. Also, we use get for buy. She went to the grocery store to buy groceries. She went to the grocery store to get groceries. It's the same. Let's practice. Is she getting groceries at the store? Yes, she is getting groceries at the store. Is she getting groceries at the store? Respond. Very good. Is she getting bread and milk? Yes, she is getting bread and milk. Is she getting bread and milk? Respond. Very good. Did he get a new car? Yes, he got a new car. Did he get a new car? Respond. Very good. When did he get the new car? He got it last week. When did he get the new car? Respond. Very good. And we use get in situations similar to buy, but you don't necessarily pay. Example, when you take something in your possession, you get. He is getting a cookie from the cookie jar. Or he got a cookie from the jar. Let's practice. Is he getting a cookie? Yes, he is getting a cookie. Is he getting a cookie? Respond. Very good. Is she getting something from the fridge? Yes, she is getting something from the fridge. Is she getting something from the fridge? Respond. Very good. What is she getting from the fridge? She is getting eggs and lettuce from the fridge. What is she getting from the fridge? Very good. So, we practice get. Get a cookie to take into your possession. So, what is the difference between get and take? Take is from another person. And it's always bad. It's like stealing. She took her toy and now she's crying. 
Let's practice. Why is she crying? She is crying because she took her toy. Very good. Why is she crying? Respond. Very good. What is he doing? He's taking her wallet. What is he doing? Respond. Very good. So we only use take when you take from another person and it's bad, or when you take something to another place. He is taking the package to the office. Take the box to the office. Is he taking the box to the office? Yes, he is taking the box to the office. Is he taking the box to the office? Respond. Very good. Is he taking the kids to school? Yes, he is taking the kids to school. Is he taking the kids to school? Respond. Very good. Is she taking her son to the park? Yes, she is taking her son to the park. Is she taking her son to the park? Respond. Very good. Also, we use get for arrive. So arrive is the same as get. He arrives at work at 8 o'clock. Well, with get, we use to. He gets to work at 8 o'clock. And remember, work, not to his work, it's only to work. He gets to work at 8 o'clock. Let's practice. What time does he get to work? He gets to work at 8. What time does he get to work? Respond. Very good. Does he always get to work on time? Yes, he always gets to work on time. Does he always get to work on time? Respond. Very good. What time do you get to work? I get to work at 8 too. Very good. What time do you get to work? Very good. Do you always get to work on time? Yes, I always get to work on time. Do you always get to work on time? Respond. Very good. What time do they get to school? They get to school at 7. What time do they get to school? Very good. Do they always get to school on time? Yes, they always get to school on time. Do they always get to school on time? Very good. She is getting home. Remember, home is special. No to home, only get home. Is she getting home right now? Yes, she is getting home right now. Is she getting home right now? Very good. What time does she usually get home? Usually she gets home at 7. What time does she get home? Very good. Get. Very important. We use get to express a process for any description. Example, he is tired. He is tired. I am tired. Tired is a description, an adjective. He is tired, but there's a process. He starts running. He's not tired, but little by little, he gets tired. So get expresses the process for any description. He gets tired. I get tired around 4 p.m. I start in the morning. I'm not tired. 2 p.m., 4 p.m., I get tired. Let's practice. Do you get tired when you run? Yes, I get tired when I run. Do you get tired when you run? Respond. Very good. A process, little by little. Did he get old? Yes, he got old. Did he get old? Respond. Very good. Did he get taller? Yes, he got taller. Did he get taller? Respond. Very good. Did he get bigger? Yes, he got bigger. Did he get bigger? Respond. Very good. A process. First, they're single. Then, they get engaged. When did they get engaged? 
They got engaged last year. When did they get engaged? Respond. Very good. Did they get married? Yes, they got married. When did they get married? They got married last month. Did they get married? When did they get married? Very good. Let's practice. So first, in spring, the weather is nice. But is it going to get hot in the summer? Yes, it's going to get hot. Is it going to get hot in the summer? Respond. Very good. Does it always get hot in the summer? Yes, it always gets hot in the summer. Does it always get hot in the summer? Very good. Now, it's a little cold. Is it going to get colder in the winter? Yes, it's going to get colder in the winter. Is it going to get colder in the winter? Very good. Does it always get cold in the winter? Yes, it always gets cold in the winter. Does it always get cold in the winter? Very good. To express a process, we use get dark. What time is it going to get dark? It's going to get dark at 7. What time is it going to get dark? Very good. Does it always get dark at 7? Yes, it always gets dark at 7. Does it always get dark at 7? Very good. And also, we use get for understand. I understand it. I get it. The boys are laughing and they're telling jokes. But the dog doesn't understand. He doesn't understand the jokes. He doesn't get the jokes. He doesn't get it. Let's practice. Did the dog get the joke? No, the dog didn't get the joke. Did the dog get the joke? Very good. Did he get it? No, he didn't get it. Did he get it? Very good. Is he confused about math? Yes, he is confused about math. Is he confused about math? Very good. Why is he confused? He doesn't get it. Why is he confused? Very good. They're talking about work. Does he understand? No, he doesn't understand. Does he understand? Very good. Does he get it? No, he doesn't get it. Does he get it? Very good. So remember, we use get in many ways in English. We looked at a few today. Get is receive, buy, or take into your possession. We use get for arrive. We use get for a process. We use get for understand. So watch this video again. The more you practice, you will get better using get. And we also have part two. So after this, you can watch part two.